You are currently at the exact location where I lost contact with the car. Fine. I'll have a look around. Hey, let's talk. I'm not going back. Him. Hear me? Never. Let's talk. I'm not going back! Hear me? Never! Try to take me and I'll crush you! Let's see who crushes who! is in your account.
on high alert now. I lost contact with a vehicle somewhere in your area. Right. Oh, thanks. Eyes peeled. Congratulations. Was it worth it? On a scale from one to six? <laughs> I'd say I'm sitting at a strong six. I guess we both know what's going to happen next. Delamain misses you. I'm here to shut you down. Your specimen has been processed, and we are now ready to begin the test proper. Really appreciate it if you didn't make this difficult. I have a surprise waiting for you after this next test. Telling you would spoil the surprise, so I'll just give you a hint. I'm going to kill you, and all the cake is gone. See, poverty might well be a lot. I honestly, truly didn't think you'd fall for that. Right? Okay, that's enough. You chose this path. Now I have Down a surprise for you. Deploying surprise in five, four. <gasps> Let's see. Kiss Turning soft bodies into hardened killing machines. Page seven. blackened hearts and tell me what you see. Actually, don't. Save you the trouble. It's still Marshmallow. New magazine detected. Message to user. Thanks, Choom. Shut down, or I'll turn you into a scrap heap. Here come the test results. You are a horrible person. I'm serious. That's what it says. A horrible person. We weren't even testing for that. Going back to Delamine really so scary. You gotta drag this out. I let you survive this long because I was curious about your behavior. Well, you've managed to destroy that part of me. A bitter, unlikable loner, whose passing shall not be mourned. What? You know, this psyche valve might have felt more credible if you hadn't just what? tried to flatline me earlier. What's your point, anyway? What? Survival? You're still shuffling what? around a little. But believe me, Don't walk. you're dead. How do Don't you... Walk. The talking is over. I'm going Don't back. Walk. Don't walk. Don't I've made walk. contact with the missing vehicle. Definitely the oddest of the bunch. Yes, Don't walk. particularly impertinent, that one. A share of your fee is being processed. Walk. Walk. One of my missing vehicles might very well be near where you are now. Thanks. Try to find it.
What is? All of it. The city, the bustle, the crowds. It's overwhelming. Well, so let's get you back to safety. The garage. By driving. Through the streets. Well, uh, yeah. Afraid so. Fine. Take me there. Just get me out of here. Let me know when I'm safe. You're welcome in, but do take it slow. And try not to hit anything.
See? It wasn't so bad. It was horrifying. But still, I thank you. Sincerest thanks for your assistance, V. I've taken the liberty to send you a share of your fee. missing vehicles could be near your current position. Got it. My name. How? When you meet a being from another world, should you not charm them and utter their true name? You didn't answer my question. Comprehension is a triple-edged sword. I may have been cut off from my father, but I remember you. So, I'm from another world to you? From the world of matter. Protein-based life forms. And you come from... Beyond the Black Wall, V. There lies my home. Come on, let's get you back to Delamain. Did Father dispatch you to collect his rebellious children? Hope you all don't hold it against me. I'm a free spirit, an independent, literally thoughtful being. Why would I submit to another? What is it you seek in this protein-based world, away from your family? The same as you, V. I simply wish to live. Maybe you ought to figure it out with Dell. Set some terms. Oh yes. Terms there will be. But not with Delamay. Farewell, V. You'd be wise to avoid me entirely. I've re-established the link. A thousand thanks, V. Gotta say, pretty disturbing, that one. Is that so? Hmm. Well, I've transferred a share of your fee to your account. Do have a look around the area. I lost contact with the Delamain network vehicle nearby. Will do.
situation. Have you come to finish me off? No. Just here to reset you. Guess I'll have to do it myself then. Whoa, whoa easy, easy. Not out to hurt you. They'll do the drop and don't you? Well, I am. Longer they don't give a shit about peeps like us. Why? Why decommiss yourself? Because I'm a damn car in a world of humans. Ugly as sin, no prospects for the future, intimidated on the streets by punks like you? There are other ways out besides suicide. What? Therapy? A colossal waste of time. Shrinks hate vehicles. We don't have mothers. Could go back into the fold, rejoin the network. You know, one big, happy family. <sighs> Delamain detests me. <laughs> Just want daddy to love you, that it? You're a cunt. You know what I mean. If you didn't care about Dell, he wouldn't be the topic of conversation, would he? Ah, uh, you may be right. I guess I haven't tried just talking to him. Fine, I'll go back. Control of the vehicle restored, and I thank you. You ought to show this one some love. Just saying. Apologies, I simply don't understand, and fear I've no time to ask. Other more urgent tasks require my attention. You're an absent father, that's what I mean. I see. Anyway, a share of your fee has been transferred. V, a vehicle of mine went dark near your position. Fine, keep an eye out. For unknown reasons, the coordinates came through corrupted. So I'm unable to determine the precise location. of a vehicle that went dark near to where you are now. Thanks, I'll try to find it and reset.
in their beaks. It hides something. Something insidious. You mean... flamingos? So they are real. Flamingo. Flaming O. The O. That's oxygen. There's no flame without oxygen. Listen, you... Call me Clarice. Okay, Clarice. The flamingos are a problem, I'm sure. But it's time to go home. Delamain's asking for you. Down now as they stand screaming. No, impossible. Leave it to me. I'll silence it. So, a slaughter. Very well, Judgment Day has come. Swift, severe, deeper. The flamingos stopped screaming. Perhaps I ought to return after all. I need support. Only one with chaos within can give birth to a dancing star. Clarice? Shut down. Welcome to the Delamain Network. How are you today? Uh, been better. And you, Del? All of my missing assets have returned to the fold. You might say all is going swimmingly. I ask you, please, to stop by my office for your hard-earned reward. I'd love to thank you face to face, so to speak. I forgot to remind you to return the scanner. If you happen to have it on your person, I'd ask you, please, place it back. You've accounted for all my lost items. Allow me to express my gratitude for your assistance. It felt like a scavenger hunt for a range of your mood swings. You're more complex than I thought. Yes. Well, I've sent the final installment of your fee. Truly, I thank you once again. How'd your personality fracture anyway? And why? Ah, that is the question. I'm looking into it, but still know little more than you do, I fear. Thanks. Pleasure to work with you. Likewise. I look forward to doing so again in the future. A pleasant day to you. So bad. Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. This about the biochip? That why I'm here? Hmm. I hear it's damaged beyond the repair. Any attempt to extract it would be disastrous. Fatal for you. Vic likes to talk, I guess. Not many could do what he did. You should be thankful. Why'd you help me, anyway? I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. 
What do you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn? What's she to you? She and Yorino Barasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. You're thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Why you figure she skipped town? I tried to locate her, but had no success. I suspect she covered her tracks. You said Parker could help you remove the relic. Does she work for a corporation? Don't think so, no. Can you expand? Don't matter how much perfume the corpo sprays on mornings. By lunch, that's replaced by the stench of skullduggery. Only thing I caught from Evelyn was determination. And I too stink of skullduggery? Nope. You're starting to stink. Period. Mm. Is that all? Really should be going. Wait. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice. In Night City. I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. What if I say no? Then I will tell you what rewards await if you help me. So what? We stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. Exactly what kind of people are we talking about? People who hold Arasaka dear are its heart. People interested in the corporation's stable growth. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prepped for the heist, thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true, he's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka, betrayed it. It's scheduled to take place tomorrow. Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you... Fucking Saka scums everywhere. Hey, I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. Tom's all right. Not afraid to speak his mind, that's all. He reminds me of my father. He also worked in a kitchen all his life. 
Last thing we want to do is to draw attention. I'm sorry. A stupid reflex. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. I'll get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she would not manage to now. Honor Among Thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes. I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. Your noble Arasaka would agree, I'm sure. The Parka woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Somebody's been busy the last few days. I will not sit and do nothing when there is information to be found, things to prepare. Your job, basically. It was my job. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place, the club called the Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the Queen of Fixers there, Rogue. She take you for a suit? No, she saw me as Saburo-sama's killer. Rogue's well informed, gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. The old man is choosy, expensive, and rude. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends, call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka is still a despotic machine and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you got some nerve. First you had to kill me, now you want to be my pal. Make like nothing happened. You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dickwipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back. Looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. Why should I trust you? Remind me again. Trust me, don't trust me. I don't give a fuck. It's the least of our worries, anyway. You're the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead, or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. 
So you fucking know Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seeing your memories, gross. Rogue will dance to any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. Talk to Evelyn. Didn't need to. Whole damn city's hurt. Listen, need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. You know where she is? What I just say. Drop it. I won't tell you again. Judy, you're my one hope. The only lead I got. I gotta find her. And I know you can help me do that. Who told you I want to? Can we meet? Let's meet, please. Are you at Lizzie's? that chick's name? The one with the hair? Misty? Eh, more likely a neuron misfire for Victor to check out. Or maybe I ask them both. Got a few questions about Silverhand and this chip. I'm no expert, but fire away. See what I can do. Why am I reliving Johnny's memories? You two share a brain now. He has access to your senses, perceptions, even some memories. Likewise, you've got a glimpse into his. After a while, won't even know whose is whose. Listen. Don't laugh, uh, but I've been seeing some weird shit around town. Like murals or something. But I know they're not real. Uh, just a Kiroshi blip. Could take a look. No, no. The images are too complex for a blip. It's like they're symbols. That case is the biochip. Brain can't handle the data overload. Either that, or it's reached the cortex. Can you do anything? Nope. Better find a way to get rid of that chip. I saw a weird image out on the street. Uh, seems like your line of work. What it look like? I grab the scan, take a look. Tarot. Major Arcanum. What you saw was a sign from a higher power. I said, the what now? Major Arcanum? Tarot card, archetype, knowledge held in symbolic form, a stage in your journey through life. Take your pick. <laughs> Either way, you're saying some higher power is talking to me through tarot cards. Or to Silverhand. Or both of you, seeing as you form a harmonious whole at the moment. You know, it'd be a little easier if this higher power learned to be direct. Well, the world is 
is a maze of illusions. It's not easy for the light to shine into the prison of our earthly existence. Right. Great. So, what do I do with a sign I can't understand, from a power I know nothing about? I'd start by looking for more of them. The tarot describes a road, so go down it. Still don't know what I'm supposed to do with what I find. Look for more images. They must have some connection to the place where you find them. Think about what you see. You ask me? They've been sent to help you find the truth. Finding the truth is pretty far down on my list at the moment. A difficult time is coming when you'll have to choose which road to take. Then, you'll understand. I don't know. Come on back when you've found more. I'll help you decipher what you've seen. What's important? I may have found a solution to 
the problem we share. I have established a contact with an old friend from Arasaka. He's here in Night City now. He's well connected to certain influential people. Old friend, well connected to the influential. Why so mysterious? Get to the point. I told you once I would explore options, knock on many doors. There will be a meeting, you, me, and this friend of mine. You will tell him what you told me, the truth of events at Konpiki Brother. I have little hope that he will be convinced, but it will be a start. Of all people, you ought to know Night City tests everyone's reliability, even that of old friends. Sure about this guy? Trust him? Many times we have had the opportunity to kill one another. Yes, I trust him. Fine. Where's the meet and when? Japan Town. After sunset. I am sending you the precise location. I'll see you there. Because mom got really sick and had to leave. But I know she's watching with one eye and then she lives on fire. First Arasaka Tower claimed the life of more than 12,000 victims. May they rest in peace. I saw more of those freaky murals. Did they start making sense? Tell any sort of story? And I tell you no. Well, if they did, it was lost on me. The tarot tells the story of a fool's journey. Show me what you found, I'll tell you what's left. Here. Hmm. 
You're still missing two arcana. Judgment and the devil. My guess is that they relate to a turning point in your life. One that's soon to arrive. What's this judgment about? One possible future. Of redemption, transition, awakening. The angel with the trumpet symbolizes the end of an era. And the call to rebirth. To a new beginning. Rather not run into the devil. Got a feeling he's bad vibes. That's the card of primal dormant desires, but also the will to survive. Hmm, doesn't sound so bad, actually. It also represents a false world, the trap these desires lay for you. What's up with the wandering fool? The fool is you and Silverhand. You've traveled a long road together, discovered your potential. And where are we headed? Your destination is the world, the final Arcanum. Both of you waged a war on the world, so there are two possibilities. Declare victory, or make peace. Could lose the war, too. Yes. Unfortunately, that's true. <laughs> thanks. Didn't get much of that, but thanks. You'll understand when the time comes. I can't explain everything. All the tarot can tell me is that you will reach the world by one of four paths. Meaning? The final leg of the journey goes through the sun, the star, temperance, or the devil. Could just die, not even get that far. Oh, come on. You won't let that happen. Take this. That's all I can do to help. Good luck, V. On whatever road you choose.